Today on CTV News at 5, bike lane controversy. The Royal City is taking action to address a problem intersection, and there is a push to have the McDonald's restaurant in Guelph reorient its drive through in the name of safety. Guelph residents call the intersection one of the most dangerous in this city. CTV's Krista Sharp has been following this story for us, and Krista, you have more details than what we can expect. Ricardo and Shannon, it's been called the perfect storm. A busy street, a drive through and a bike lane sandwiched in the middle. The city says that Gordon Street and Surrey Street was the most dangerous intersection for cyclists last year. Between 2015 and 2019, 29 collisions were reported at the intersection of Gordon and Surrey. 15 of those involved injuries. But it's not just right at the corner. The city of Guelph says 25 collisions were reported mid-block between Surrey and Wellington. Seven of those involved injuries. On Friday, the city installed concrete curbs and highly visible bollards to the southbound bike lane. It was also widened slightly from 1.8 meters to 2. But drivers continue to block both the bike lanes and the sidewalk. So this is a perfect example. That's a bad driver. I don't mind saying that out loud, okay? That's a bad driver. They should not be blocking the lane. They should not be blocking the sidewalk. And uh, it, that, this is what uh, ticks me off and ticks a lot of people off. Be a good driver. We shouldn't even have to put infrastructure like this in here. Coming up at 6, we'll explain why a restaurant entrance like this one is no longer allowed, but this one is specifically was grandfathered in. We'll also talk to Guelph Police. Ricardo and Shannon. Krista, thank you. Well, let's go to CTV's Tony Grace now with a look at what's coming up on CTV News at 6. Thank you, Ricardo. Good afternoon, everyone. A series of anti-vaccine protests getting...